That was close. Oh. -ho. Hey guys, Link to Yoshi here, bringing you a late Evolution of Zelda video. Not really, it's just one day late, you can deal with it, right? Anyway, this week, as suggested by Mr. Jeremy Gaming, is the evolution of Ganondorf's theme. This theme appears in the final dungeons in the games or cutscenes featuring Ganon. It was first seen in A Link to the Past and is still seen today in A Link Between Worlds. Anyway, let's get off the show. Thank you, Mr. Jeremy, for the suggestion, and let us go! As I said earlier, Ganon's theme is first seen in Link to the Past. However, it is not heard in his tower or his boss fight, but assuming it is during cutscenes. However, I have not played Link to the Past. Yes, I know, that's kind of weird, but it's only, I'm assuming, it's only putting cutscenes. set free all the sages, and now all that is left to do is to scale Ganon's tower and save Hyrule. You crossed the magical bridge of happiness and rainbows that the sages made, dispelled all of the barriers in the main central hub, now all that is left to do is kill Ganondorf. You enter the main tower and begin to scale to the top, and all you hear is that ominous organ music, until... In an attempt to stop Ganondorf from reclaiming the Triforce, the gods flood the once beautiful kingdom of Hyrule. However, it didn't work. Ganondorf makes his home in the Forsaken Fortress and seeks the Triforce once more. You finally confront him in this new home, and this is what you hear. Gives you a feeling of dread, like you're hopeless. I mean, literally, he just swings his hand and you go flying. You feel so hopeless now. But oh, baby, once you get the Master Sword to full power, you're ready to face the King of Evil. You stumble into his twisted tower in Hyrule. This theme in particular that plays in this tower has a twisting sound to it. It fits very nicely when you fight the decolored bosses and enter the Phantom Maze. So, you're Ganondorf. I've been dying to meet you. <laughs> As you slowly make your way up to the top of Hyrule Castle, Ganon's theme is playing in the background to this epic finale of this epic game. It starts off slow, 
and eerie, relating to all of the lost ones who are killed in the twilight. As you make your way higher and higher, a storm begins to brew, and the music becomes darker and faster. You see more and more dead Hyrule soldiers, broken stairs, and ruin. The fate of Hyrule seems to be gripping out of your hands. You see it, the Golden Dark Knight. He blocks your path and is the one final challenge before him. You swing your sword and defeat the foe and open the throne room. You step inside to the raging hurricane not knowing what lies ahead. The grand conclusion to this wonderful game. However, I just wish there was more to the final boss, which is not Ganondorf, by the way. Well, it technically is. He's just merged with Yuga and has gone all. Blah, blah, blah. However, that does not matter. As you make your way through Little Castle, much like Hyrule Castle from Twilight Princess, the theme builds on itself to a grand theme of e epicness, evil, and dread. Now. This theme is not entirely Ganondorf's theme, but it does include it. Here, listen. 